Welcome back to Eagles Primetime Live. The XTU Student Athlete of the Week is brought to you by Jim Sapala's Key of Westchester and Key of Coatesville.com. Always remember, Jim Sapala wants to see you in a Kia. We're back. Eagles Primetime Live at Chickies and Pete's. Todd Harriman's Riley Cooper and our Student Athlete of the Week. This is Alyssa Oriskovich. 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 Oh, I was close. <laughs> It is Alyssa, though, not it's Alyssa. Alyssa. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> or like Kelsey would say, Alyssa! <laughs> <laughs> We're going to hear that in a little bit. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That was So we had, um, we had Todd and Jason do a dramatic reading last week, and we're going to hear it in about 15 minutes from now. But right now we're focusing on you, our student athlete, Alyssa. Tell us about you. Where do you go to school? How old are you? What are your sports? Um, I go to Drexel Hill Middle School. Mm-hmm. I'm 12 years old, and I play softball, field hockey, and basketball. Fantastic. Awesome. Are they, all these people here for you? Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Hey, crowd, how are you guys doing? Let's hear it for Alyssa. She's got quite awesome. the following. Yeah. So you have a question for the guys? Um, yeah. Um, at what age did you start playing football? Ooh, I started, my parents wouldn't let me play football when I was very young because they thought that I would get injured. So I played mm. soccer until I was in eighth grade. And uh, that's when I started playing football. Did you get injured playing soccer? No. No. Pretty big kid. (laughs) Did you injure anyone playing soccer? Yeah. (laughs) (laughs) If I could catch him. (laughs) You're no Jason Kelsey out there. No. No. Okay. You have good hips is what you're saying, right? You just don't have... How about you, Riley Cooper? Uh, I started in sixth grade. I don't know how old that is, though. Around... What age is that? Let's see. I don't know. Alyssa, what grade are you in? I'm in seventh. Okay. So, so you're like 11? 11. I was 11 okay. when I started playing. I was 11. So I was so 14. Was 14. <laughs> I started young. So really, was that like a peewee <laughs> league or was that a school league? At that uh, point? It was school. Yeah. Yeah. How'd you, how was your team? Decent. See, that's good. Man. Fighting that's Eagles. I was the Eagles. I know. Poor, in middle school. Poor Doc has a Wait. son who's on a terrible football team. They've, uh, they took, <laughs> no, it's true. Wow. I mean, I don't know that they've that ever so won. They took their best loss and this past to weekend. The show? When See? You, yeah. all right, they're strides. celebrating their best loss. Yeah. That's how bad the team is. They lost 21-14. They were celebrating on uh, Friday. That, that was a good one. Sound too promising. But the other ones were like 50-something to six, and <laughs> it, was, it was bad. They celebrate all those, too, at that age, though, right? Yeah, pretty much. He yeah, comes home, he's all upset until the next morning. Let's he's go out for breakfast. School. Let's go do something. This yeah. is high school. It's not this like he's school. peewee. Yeah. yeah, he's a senior in high school now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so don't look at me as the bad team. It's a guys. bad team. <laughs> and so, so I feel bad for the coach because he's a brand new guy. But they're a very small team. And so he's got to work with what he has until they can start bringing bigger kids up. So I'm, I'm well, Sean's for a big the coach. kid, yeah, Doc. Yeah. He's a big kid. My son's a lineman like you, uh, but he's a side lineman. He, uh, <laughs> but he was an offensive line. He's defense. He's like, for, for example, if he was on the Eagles roster, he'd be playing right now. But he wouldn't have been starting the first game of the season. <laughs> there we go. Let's move on. <laughs> He's a sideline man. I like that. Yeah. You have another question for the Where, guys, Alyssa. Where's it like a badge? <laughs> yes. Um, throughout your life, have you made every team you tried out for? And what advice could you give to kids who have not made teams that they have tried out for? Mm. Go ahead, Riley. Um, well, growing up, I was very fortunate. I was always, um, you know, pretty athletic. So I always, I did make um, every team that I tried out for. Um, but I mean, if I had to give advice um, to someone, to someone that you know maybe didn't make a team or is having trouble, um, I just tell them if they love it, just keep continuing to try to get better and do everything necessary. You know, with like practicing and things. Um, but don't just do it because, you know, your friends are doing it or your, or your friends want you to do it. Do it because you love it. What about you, Todd? Todd? Well, I, uh, I, I, I also was a specimen of athleticism when I was growing up, so I didn't get cut either. <laughs> <laughs> this is the humblest crowd we've ever worked with. <laughs> uh, no, I... Really, where I grew up, there's uh, not that many people on our team, so we couldn't really afford to cut people. Um, small town. But, um, 
you know, I, I guess uh, the best example would be Michael Jordan. He was cut from a basketball team, right, in, in high school or something like that. Mm -hmm. Just keep on persevering, push through. That's okay. right. So um, are you thinking about the future? Do you have a sport you really want to focus on? or? Um, probably softball. Yeah? Yeah. Great. And what position do you play in softball? Um, outfield and second base. Very cool. I could awesome. never get second base down. Like, there's a lot of responsibility there. I was a first baseman. <laughs> Seriously. It's like first base, you just cover first base. That's, That's all it. I can handle. And I'm tall, Catch so the I have ball. long reach. Yeah. Big range. Right, right. Second base is like, run here, run there. Sometimes you cover second base. Sometimes the shortstop does. <laughs> I can't think. <laughs> And then you get into radio. <laughs> <laughs> and just, here I am. I just wasn't happening for you. So it's, it's but you brought out, something for us, Alyssa. What did you bring? Um, yes, I brought um, cupcakes from Sophisticates Bakery in Jexel Hill. Ooh. Ooh. We like cupcakes. Is there anything special about these cupcakes? Um, they're eagles, and they have um, pictures of each other and 3-0 and on them. Oh, 3-0. Oh, nice. That is the theme of tonight's show. That is Todd loves. Awesome. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Look at that, Jason Kelsey. I've never seen so much hair on a cupcake before. <laughs> yes, you have. <laughs> the bakery would not be so proud of that. I don't think. <laughs> <laughs> that is, these are beautiful. Yeah, awesome. these are awesome. That's Thank great. you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Appreciate Alyssa. Alyssa. Yeah. Let's hear it for Alyssa. It was a pleasure, everybody. Alyssa. When you do get rattled, uh, just on the all the time, I talked about before last night in the game, where if you do get rattled,